Dr. Tyson Lord and Ice, Hugh Cayley here from Richmond, California. During the most of my life, if you read a layman's book on cosmology, it would confidently state that if you somehow moved in a straight line long enough, you end up where you started. Is this still the case now that the universe is thought to be flat? Thanks. So that, what he's remembering, was not that statement given confidently. It was that statement given as one of the alternatives of what the shape of the universe would do for you. Okay. So I don't believe that that was stated confidently. We didn't know. But we had the formulas to tell us what the universe would look like depending on if it was saddle-shaped, spherical, or flat. It turns out the universe is flat. Okay. So no, you don't come back to where you are. You don't come back. You right. don't come back. It's forever. You just keep going. Oh, by the way, and if it weren't flat, and if it was um, positively curved, then the coming back happens because the universe would recollapse on itself. Right. And, and everything's back in the same place at the same time. So that's how you end up back where you are. Mm -hmm. it's, that's, that, it's that future space-time right. trajectory that brings you back. Time would be in a loop in the case of, with the universe recollapsing. Right. All right. But how about just we are here. If we're in a spherical universe, you walk straight. Eventually, you come right back to where you started. And it's no different from walking on Earth. Right. Same difference here. Same difference. That's the way And, and when people say, where's the edge of the universe in that scenario, I'd say it has no edge. It's got to have an edge. It has no edge.